What's going on, party people? It is your boy, Kip. So, if you have finished the campaign, you got the broken necklace from Petra, because she only gives you broken things. That's what happens when you accept gifts from a one-eyed woman. I mean, a woman in general, that's going to be an issue, but she has one eye, then, then you're completely done for. It's going to be a broken necklace. <laughs> Nine out of ten times, broken necklace. So... The Broken Talisman Exotic Quest, I believe it's an exotic quest, it's yellow. You're first going to want to go to the jet stream of Saturn, and that's going to be right here. And you're going to jump over this rock into the hole in the ground. Okay, guys, you know what I'm talking about? Then you're going to go around. Right here, when you get to the second hole, do not jump in it. But there is a ghost right here on the side. And why do I put that in there, guys? Because this is a nutritious video, okay? I put little nuggets in there, things that you may want for your own nutritional value. So you're going to kill a gigantic servitor in here. I don't need to show you guys how to do that. You shoot it in the hole, and it dies. Then you're going to jump across, open the chest, at which point in time you will get the little talisman piece, the fragment of the talisman. But be careful, it does not always pop up on your screen when you retrieve this. There appears to be some sort of a bug with the UI. There you can see an old, uh, I can't tell if that's Corsair or Corsair. Or did I just say the same word? Maybe I did. <laughs> Maybe I did. So there's where the spider is. There's his hangout. And right here is the lost sector for the spider's web, inside the spider's web, I think it's called. I'm not going to show you any part of this lost sector because it's so awesome. Like, it's so cool. It's those things that makes you know, like a, someone enjoys making video games. So whoever made this Lost Sector, good job, dude. Because there was more um, in this Lost Sector than there was in all of Destiny 2 up until this uh, expansion. Like, literally, this Lost Sector was cooler than Warmind or the Cur Curse of Osiris. <laughs> it was just that good. So look, as you can see there, I got two blues. It did not pop up on my screen when I finished it. So I had to go here and check manually, and yes, in the heart of the spider's web is indeed finished. For the very last one, I think it's called like in a green place or in a quiet green place. I know half of y'all just stuck your finger right up your nose. That is not where it's at. So you go up the elevator here to the top of the asteroid. Yes, there's, a, there's an asteroid elevator. You're going to see this is where the uh, bomb baron, the bomb baron, was. I don't know if you all have already gotten to this part. Yeah, you have because you had to have beaten it. So when you go to the bomb baron part, this is where he's obviously laying it for somebody else right now. There's the elevator, that Jabba the Hut looking house right in front of me. Boom, right there. So you run into this canyon straight out the front door. I just passed it because I'm retarded. So I'll go back. There we go. And you get in there. This is the last one. This one's super easy. You can see it's right there in the middle of, I think it's called Four Horn Glitch or something like that. Four something glitch or gulch. This one's going to be a lot of close quarter combat. So, you know, not that it matters. Just punch everything. If you don't have a close quarters weapon, you open the deal and you're completely done with this quest line. So at this point in time, you turn this in to the spider and he's going to give you the next section of the quest and I would have just made a separate video for that step except for it's only to shoot people so you gotta kill a bunch of Taken to charge up the talisman at this point in time and I decided to go to IO to do this you can go wherever you want obviously there's apparently a strike that's, uh, that's pretty good for this but I just went to IO I went to the back and you can see right here where the public event spawn that's all taken this one public event completed 33% of that requirement. So maybe there is a much faster way to do this, guys. I'm not Stephen Hawking, okay? I don't know everything. I'm just saying this is what I did. It, took, it was 33% in one run. That seemed like a decent uh, percentage, a decent outcome for the amount of effort I put into that. So it is very possible that someone already put out a guide for this exact thing at some point last night while I was sleeping. I finished editing this at 3 a.m., but there was no way I was going to talk, guys. I sounded retarded. Maybe you think I sound retarded already. Well, I sounded more retarded, so that is why this is coming out a little bit late. If you've already seen it, then I apologize. Anyways, y'all, that is going to be all for me. I will be back later with a review for the campaign aside of Forsaken. Until then, peace.